Uh, one of the issues threatening to derail any budget deal is a fight over something called vegetative buffers. Unless you're a farmer, you probably have no idea what those are. Here's an example of a grass buffer. They're supposed to absorb and block farm chemicals from draining into Minnesota rivers and lakes. A law requiring farmers to put in 50-foot buffers in specially designated areas was supposed to go into effect in November. But as Esme Murphy reports, farmers say the buffer law is too costly and too confusing. Governor Mark Dayton has said the buffers are one of his top priorities. Well, it's a big deal for Minnesota. You know, our uh, places, our water is undrinkable. And, you know, buffers are one way you can uh, reduce the amount of runoff. But farmers have been fighting back. Earlier this month, 18 Minnesota farm organizations wrote Governor Mark Dayton asking for changes and a delay in the implementation of the law. The farmers argue the buffers are too costly, not only requiring them to spend money planting and maintaining them, but that it also would mean less land for crops. Republicans say they have been inundated with complaints. It's a contentious issue for farmers. Uh, they, they feel like in many cases this is kind of a taking of their land. Another problem, confusion about the law itself. A DNR map dictates if certain farm areas are required to have the 50-foot buffers. But another part of the law, scheduled for implementation in 2018, calls for 16 and a half foot buffers for ditches. Farmers say the designations can appear random, something we found in rural Dakota County. While this side of 250th Street is in the mandated DNR protected area requiring a 50 foot buffer, the other side of the street is not protected with no required buffer at all. Now, late last night, a compromise was reached that would delay by eight months the implementation of the buffer requirement from November of this year to the middle of next summer. It's all part of the environment bill. That bill has been sent to the governor's desk, although the governor has not yet said if he will sign it. The revised one, that's a little yes. more clear. Huh. Yes. Well, I guess we'll wait and see. Absolutely. A lot of stuff will happen. A lot, a lot of stuff to wait and see yeah. about. <laughs> or, or not, I guess so. All right, thanks, Esme.